Next example, employ Taylor series method to find y at x equal to 0.1 and 0.2, correct to 4 decimal places in step size of 0.1, given the linear differential equation dy by dx minus 2y equal to 3 into e raised to x, whose solution passes through the origin. Also find y of 0.1 and 0.2 by analytical method. B compute y of the compute y of 0.1 solution. So again here also they have mentioned the step size and asked to find y for 0.1 and 0.2 and keeping the step size as 0.1. So we have to solve this example in two steps. Considering initial condition as and the, what they have mentioned this equation passes through the origin means what initial conditions for x as 0.1 is x0 is 0 0 and then using them for 0.2 x equal to 0.1 x as a initial condition so by data y dash is equal to 2y plus 3 into e raised to x and y of 0 is equal to 0. That is y equal to y naught is 0 at x naught equal to 0. So as you know write down the Taylor series expansion. Taylor series expand y of x is equal to y of x naught plus x minus x naught into y dash of x naught plus x minus x naught whole square by 2 factorial y double dash of x naught so call this as equation 1 step 1 or first stage for first stage we shall compute y of point 1 so consider the given differential equation that is y dash equal to 2y plus 3 into e raised to x then y dash of 0 is 2 times y of 0 plus 3 into e raised to 0 y of 0 is 0 plus 3 e raised to 0 is 1 so it is 3 when you differentiate y double dash so it is 2 times y dash plus 3 into differentiation of e raised to x is e raised to x so y double dash of 0 is 2 times y dash of 0 plus 3 into e raised to 0 2 into y dash of 0 is 3 and this is 3 6 plus 3 it will be 9 y triple dash is 2 times y double dash again 3 into e raised to x so y triple dash of 0 2 times y double dash of 0 into 3 into e raised to 0 so 2 times y double dash of 0 is 9 and 3 so it is 21 so from equation 1 we have y of 0.1 is equal to y of 0 y of 0 0.1 y dash of 0 plus 0.1 whole square by 2 into y double dash of 0 plus 0.1 whole cube by 6 into y triple dash of 0. by considering
टर्म्स अप टू थर्ड डिग्री ओनली फर्दर वी हैव because in the example what they have mentioned correct up to four decimal places answer should be correct up to four decimal places that's why we may take up to y triple dash so y of 0.1 is y of 0 is 0 plus 0.1 y dash of 0 is 3 plus 0.1 whole square 0.01 by 2 y double dash of 0 is 9 plus 0.001 by 6 into 21. When you simplify, y of 0.1 will be 0.3485. Thus, y of 0.1 is 0.3485. And in B section, ask they ask you to compute y of 0.1. So that solution completes here only. Solution of B ends here. Stage two. Now we shall compute y of point two. Consider. y that differential equation y dash equal to 2y plus 3 into e raised to x and now the initial conditions will be x not as a point 1 and y not will be point 3485 so now y dash of 0 sorry y dash of point 1 is equal to 2 times y of 0.1 plus 3 into e raised to 0.1. So this implies y of 0.1 is 0.3485 plus 3 into e raised to 0.1. e raised to 0.1 will be what? Mm. e raised to point one is one point one zero five two. When you simplify this, y dash of point one will be four point zero one two five. Then similarly, y double dash of y double dash uh, y double dash is two y dash plus three into e raised to x. Then y double dash of Point one is two times y dash of point one plus three into e raised to point one. So it is two times y dash of point one is zero one two five plus three into one point one zero five two. So when you simplify, y double dash of point one is eleven point three four zero. Y triple dash. When you differentiate this, so it is two times y double dash plus three into e raised to x. So y triple dash of point one is equal to two times y double dash of point one plus three times e raised to point one. So this is two times. Eleven point three four zero five plus three times one point one zero five two. So y triple dash of point one when you calculate, so it becomes twenty five point nine nine six five. So we got all the terms. So we have. From equation one, now y of point two is equal to 
y of 0.1 plus 0.1 into y dash of 0.1 plus 0 0.01 by 2 into y double dash of 0.1 plus 0 0.001 by 6 into y triple dash of 0.1. So substitute the values. y of 0.1 is 0.3485 plus 0.1 into y dash of 0.1 is 4.0125 plus 0 0.01 by 2 into 11.3405 plus 0 0.001 by 6 into 25.9965. So after simplifying, y of 0.2 will be 0 0.8108. This is the required solution for y of 0.2 using the Taylor series expansion. Now what they have asked solution, find the solution by analytical method also. So solution by analytical method. So what is the given differential equation? That is a dy by dx minus 2y is equal to 3 into e raised to x. How it is? It is of the form dy by dx plus p into y is equal to q. Fair. p is minus 2. q is 3 into e raised to x. You have studied these such type of uh, examples in first semester. So now these differential, this type of differential equation have a standard type of solution. So for this equation, solution is what? The solution is is of the form y into e raised to integration of p into dx is equal to integration of q into e raised to integration of p dx into dx plus c. So that is y into e raised to minus 2 dx minus 2 dx because p is minus 2. So it is equal to integration q is 3 into e raised to x e raised to integration again minus 2 dx into dx plus c. So this is nothing but y into e raised to minus 2x is equal to integration 3 into e raised to x as it is. So it is e raised to minus 2x dx plus c. Now LHS as it is y into e raised to minus 2x and simplify here so it becomes y into e raised to minus 2x is equal to 3 into e raised to x plus into e raised to minus 2x so 3 into e raised to minus x dx plus c so that is y into e raised to minus 2x equal to minus 3 e raised to minus x plus c or y is equal to minus 3 into e raised to x plus c into e raised to 2x is the general solution. Now applying the conditions What are the initial conditions? It passes through origin. So y of 0 is equal to 0. Then the general solution becomes zero. when you substitute y as 0 and x as 0. 0 is equal to minus 3 into e raised to 0 plus c into e raised to 0. Or 
what happens c is equal to or 0 is equal to minus 3 plus c or c is equal to 3 hence y equal to 3 into e raised to hence y equal to 3 into e raised to x minus e raised to x is the solution let us substitute x is equal to 0 0.1 0 0.2 then y of 0 0.1 is 3 into e raised to 2 into 0 0.1 e raised to 0 0.1 so when you simplify this it becomes 0.3487 and y of y of 0.2 is equal to 3 into e raised to 2 into 0.2 e raised to 0 0.2 is equal to 0 0.8113 that is y of 0 0.1 is 3487 y of 0 0.2 0 0.8113 are the solution by analytical method. Just compare your numerical solution and analytical solution. Just they are bit different in decimals. That's it. Thank you. In the next class, we'll in the next class I will start a next method, modified Euler's method.